Hi everyone, I'm John Morales with Photographer's Toolkit and I'm here to show to you today my lookbook for uh, bride and groom portraits and also one for infants, kids and families. And the way the lookbook is set up is there's 200 photos and tips uh, for uh, poses you can use with brides and grooms and then tips on how to achieve that pose. And the idea here is that it's set up like a swatch book so that you can quickly scan through the photos and find um, the pose that you want. And it's designed to be really compact, so you can stick it in your back pocket, you can put it in a camera bag, you can put it in a purse, and quickly gain access to the photos. Again, there's 200 photos and tips here, and because of the swatch book-like setup, you can look at almost all 200 at the same time and find the, the pose that you want. And the way that I use the book is oftentimes when I'm working with a bride and groom, I actually like to show them the, uh, the particular pose I'm interested in. What I'll do is maybe I'll, I'll have a few poses that I'll, I'll mark out ahead of time, maybe put a little sticky on, and, uh, and then I'll pull out the book and say, hey, let's try this pose. And what that does is it really allows them to vis visualize what it is that you're trying to do. Instead of trying to explain with words or, or position them, if they can see what it is you want, it's very easy for them to accomplish that. And where this really helps is with the groom. Grooms, are, especially, they don't like to look stupid, and, and, and so maybe they're a little more reserved. And uh, when they see what it is that you want them to do, then they feel like they have a job. It's like, okay, I know what I'm supposed to do, and now I just need to do it. I know I'm not going to look dumb. So that's one of the advantages of uh, uh, showing the images uh, to the subjects. Um, the other thing I like to do is I like to use this, uh, the book during engagement shoots. During weddings, there's not a lot of time, but during engagement shoots, I really have a lot more time, so I can, uh, I can really work with a lot of different poses. I can work on showing the book to my clients and say, hey, let's try this, let's try that. And what that does is build up a library of poses, so when I do get to the wedding day and things are happening really fast and there's no time, I can quickly go to those poses because I've practiced them uh, during the engagement shoot. And also, if you've worked with that particular client before, using poses from the lookbook, then uh, they're going to be more comfortable and more familiar with some of the poses as well. So again, uh, there's uh, in addition to the photos, the, the photos, there's also tips in here, um, and they correspond to the various photos, how to work uh, to get into the pose, and how to work out of that. So maybe you start with the pose, and then uh, it progresses into something else. A lot of times I like to start with something and then kind of play with it, see where it goes, and then it becomes a little more natural and realistic. 